So, unlike the 60 meter women's events, or the 60 meter event uh, for the women's, I'm not sure exactly, exactly who do I have to win for this tournament, or for this race, because the runners that I've listed that either didn't run or didn't qualify, so it's like, okay, <laughs> and only the top two qualify, I know, the top two qualify in the US for, for this event, so it's like, okay, who exactly, like, I have no idea who do I have as, have a, as a favorite, like, let's start, for example, like, uh, Caleb, Caleb McRae, uh, 4502, world leading this year, he hasn't raced, he hasn't, he did not race for the US qualifiers, which, so it's like, okay, I don't think he's gonna be racing for this year at the indoors, so it's like, okay, well, if he's not racing, then he's definitely not gonna be one of the favorites, then I look into, uh, William Jones, uh, college sophomore, yeah, so, he's probably, so yeah, he's still in the college ranks, but, uh, whether he'll win, well, I mean, listen, he was the world leading, he had the world leading time in January, and then, so, yeah, I don't think, and I, yeah, and last I checked, he's not gonna run at the Worlds, so, yeah, he didn't qualify, so, that's that right there, um, I mean, there's a lot of Americans that I found, yeah, like, Emmanuel, Emmanuel, um, uh, Bynum, I believe his name, I believe that's his name, uh, uh Judson Lincoln, uh, Brian Heron, and, uh, Matthew Bowling, all out, they're not, they're not going, so it's like, okay, well, because I think they put, they put some pretty good times this season, but, yeah, they're not going to the world, the world indoors. So really, I mean, the the one maybe that I could perhaps make a prediction for the medal position is uh, uh Brian Faust. Yeah, he could maybe make a medal position, but even then, it's like okay. Yeah, I don't think he'll win it. I I don't think he will win it. But I think the big favorite, the big favorite going into this world indoors, which who hasn't raced this season, so I was like, okay, is he going to be ready for the world indoors, or is is there going to be a new champion? Because yeah, I'm not sure exactly who if anyone's going to repeat this year. But let's just say maybe there's a chance that someone will repeat, and if there's some, if there's a chance that someone is going to repeat at this world, it's going to be this guy right here, uh, Dream Richards. I've actually. I've actually seen this guy since 2017. I think he was, uh, what's it called? Uh, at World Championships. I think it was when I first got exposed to this guy. Uh, I think he got, like, the bronze medal for, at the 200 meter. And so far, he's been doing very well. So, who knows? He could be, he could, you know, I mean, he does have to buy to get into, uh, the wild card to get into this year's um, World Indoor Championship. So, he could go through the qualifying rounds and be fine. And that will be his practice round. But then after... Or that will be his practice round. But then after that, will it be enough to get to, to win the final? I'm not so sure. But I think he's definitely one of the favorites going into this tournament. Because, I mean, honestly, everyone else, I, I'm not so sure. I'm really not so sure. Like, I mean, I guess it's a wild card name that I could pull out. Like, is someone like Ezekiel Nathaniel from Nigeria. And he ran a 45-54 a as his personal best for this... Or as his per seasonal best this season. So maybe he could medal uh there's also christopher williams another guy right there he could medal as well uh, i'm not sure i'm not so sure if he will medal but i mean there's a ch every chance that he could medal uh then havar ingvaldson ingvaldson i think that's his name uh 45 seven. i don't think he's gonna i don't think he might not i mean maybe he could make a surprise shock at, at third place but i don't think exactly he will get a medal but i think it's gonna come down between jareem richards and maybe brian faust maybe just a maybe because yeah brian faust did win the u.s championships but whether he, he, that will translate to a goal at the world i don't think it will but i think he could probably sneak himself a medal but in terms of who do i think like outside the usa outside the u.s runners who do i think is going to medal at this um pfft. the thing is these guys are also young they're very young and something i didn't take into consideration in my 60 meter women's is that experience does come in hand so i also have to take into that account and <clears throat> i'm not so sure exactly who could really pull it off the back because i think uh, yeah th it's a pretty young field so I'm, I'm gonna have to but i think but listen i think if i have to put my money on the line i think it might be dream richards to reclaim the title again at the 400 meters for the indoor so that could happen whether it will happen only time will tell we'll have to see what happens